There we go. Maybe not. Welcome back everybody, a massive welcome back to my channel. If you are new to my channel, then hit that subscribe button here, right here. Uh, thumbs up, comments, just drop them in the comment box down below. I wasn't actually going to upload this week, but because um, I wanted to concentrate on the gym, because I've kind of left the gym behind. So I wanted a week at the gym, and then I wanted to come back next Wednesday. Um, but I did try and do a little bit of a shout out yesterday, but it just wouldn't upload. Just so I was, just to mention that I was going to upload next week. But I'm not going to ramble on about that. But I am here, I'm here this week, um, thanks to Lisa Astoria, who has tagged me in the um, autumn tag, which is going about, if you don't know what the autumn tag is, it is basically 10 questions or a bunch of questions that uh, tube, tube, YouTubers are answering and then tagging somebody to answer the same questions at the end of the video. So now these, these questions are more aimed towards the females, um, so some of the questions I won't actually be able to answer. So, or I might change it anyway. But I'm, I'm not going to ramble on anymore, everybody. I'm, well, we're just going to get straight on into the video. want to say a massive happy halloween to everybody tomorrow i know it's going to be a bit different than uh, usual but it's still halloween so make sure you work on those halloween films uh, tomorrow unfortunately i'll be working so i'm going to get straight on into the questions and at the end of the video i am literally going to tag one or two people so the first question question number one um what is my favorite autumn color i know that i'm wearing brown uh, on purpose for this video because i knew it was obviously the autumn tag so but a lot of people say uh, oranges and the burgundies um but what's just come out in my garden is um holly so i love my my autumn color would probably be this i know it's more of a winter color but that is just telling you that winter is on the way um, I've got a massive holly bush, two holly bushes in the garden. Um, so my favourite autumn colour would have to be the green and the red. Because that is when you know that Christmas is literally approaching. So that would be my favourite autumn colour. Um, question number two is what is my favourite autumn outfit? And that would be, I'm going to actually put these here. Maybe not. Right, so my favourite <laughs> my favourite autumn colour uh, outfit, sorry, would have to be um it's a new coat that I've purchased and it is a fake designer. You know I love my fake designer. And that I'm not gonna show you actually, but I've got a fake designer haul coming up. So this coat will be in that fake designer haul and so that will be my favourite autumn outfit. Uh, question number three is my favourite autumn handbag, but unfortunately, well not unfortunately, I don't actually own a handbag, maybe on a weekend, but um, I'm going to change it to my favourite man bag, which would have to be, I'm going to try and promote all my other videos, it would have to be the uh, fake Louis Vuitton bag, my little gym bag that I always take to London with me. It's just so handy, it's big, it's the right size. Um, it's just a nice colour. It's brown, it's autumn, it's got your creams as well inside, and then you've got your strap, which is just heat over the shoulder. Um, so that, that'll be my my favourite autumn bag. This one right here. And if you haven't watched that video, <laughs> I'm gonna put it in the description box down below. Uh, question number four. Do I switch up makeup colours for autumn? Unfortunately, I don't wear makeup. Um, nothing really associated to makeup. Maybe a bit of um, a bit of a tint, but I literally can't answer that. So the only thing I do do is fake tan, and maybe a little bit more fake tan in the winter just to give myself a little bit colour. So I'm kind of going to skip uh, skip that question. So question number five is, what is my favourite perfume scent? Let's change it to men's cologne. It is this one here, which is the. Terry Mugler, is that how you say it? 
um, it's called Amen, and I think it is the guy that does the Alien version, um, but this is the man's version. It's not my all-time autumn scent, but it is just a nice scent. I always use that when I go out. It is like, I think it's got coffee, vanilla, uh, vanilla. It's a very sweet vanilla smell, but I know it's got coffee and it's got something else, but it is a very sweet um a little bit feminine but it's a, just a nice smell in general so anything vanilla-y sweet then that's me so question number six is my favorite autumn meal a uh, bit of an easy one it is nice to go to um you know those like pubs with the fires in so it would have to be an all-time sunday roast for me now i work sundays so i normally cook a roast on a midweek if if i can um but I did cook one on Wednesday for my mate who came came round, so I'll insert a picture of that. So if you're, you're not on my Instagram, then you want to see it. So my favourite meal would have to be the roast uh, with the Yorkshires, the wild crispy potatoes. Um, I know there's a lot of Americans thinking, what's a roast? Um, and stuffing, obviously, but I don't actually have any gravy on my roast. I know I've been slated for that on my Instagram the other day, but it would have to be a Sunday roast on a weekday. Uh, my seventh, uh, question number seven, sorry, is my favourite autumn pudding slash dessert. I'm a bit of an old schooler and I was grew growing up in the 80s. So I always buy, even summer, I always buy uh, rice pudding. I, I'm addicted to rice pudding. Um, I just love rice pudding. So that would actually be my favourite uh, pudding really. So uh, question number eight is what is my favourite autumn movie slash TV programme. It would have to be Hocus Pocus, obviously. Everybody loves Hocus Pocus now. You've got Sarah, Park, Jessica Parker, Bette Midler, and the other one as well. Um, I absolutely love Bette, Mid Bette Midler. And if you, if you haven't watched Poc Hocus Pocus, where have you been? What is this, sisters? I'll spot again. <laughs> Well, mortal bus boy. One of those. What's that? Who's that? Uh, Hobgoblin. Oh, oh. Bless you. Ah! Ah! Enough. This is dead. Um, I always have to watch Halloween as well, uh, which is Halloween number one. Simply evil. <laughs> I think you'll come back. Exploring uncharted territory. It's totally charted. Just talk. Which is the... When was that done? In 1978, I think. Maybe wrong. But Halloween, number one, I'd have to watch over Halloween and also Hocus Pocus. And question number nine, my favourite autumn traditions would have to be carving a pumpkin. It's a must. And I did go pumpkin picking the other day and it was a bit of a letdown because there was no pumpkins and I always seem to go uh, quite late. So, and it's full of kids. So, um, talking about kids, I just need to give a little Kirsty a little shout out who comes home from school also and watches my program, uh, program, watches my YouTube channel. So a little shout out to you, Kirsty. Uh, but yeah, it would have to be my tradition would have to be carving a pumpkin for Halloween. It's a must. Um, and they do do the ghost pumpkins in co-op, which are three fifty, and I nearly picked one up, up the other day, but I did hear that Audi have got the best pumpkins. I've got little Cinderella pumpkins, but yeah, that would be my tradition for Halloween. Or autumn, sorry, it would be carving a pumpkin. And the final question is, what do I like to do most in the autumn? Sorry, and that would probably just be chill out, chill out at home, candles on, um, nice meal, t film on the TV, lights dimmed, fire on, that is probably what I do. Or I don't really go out mostly in autumn, so I like to stay indoors and hibernate. So that is my 10th question, everybody. I just want to say a big thank you to Lisa Astoria who did tag me in this video. Um, and thank you so much for watching. And I just want to mention my last video, which was the Poundland Haul, has done amazingly well. And I've gained nearly 100 subscribers from that one video. So I just want to thank every single person that is still on my channel, still supporting me. Um, 
and to those hundred thank you so much for hitting that subscribe button and if you are new to my channel just hit that subscribe button i know a lot of people do watch people's videos and don't press the subscribe button does it but it does literally help so but i do want to thank lisa who i have a great collab coming up on i think wednesday which is a cherry's hall slash uh, collab with lisa astoria so thanks for tagging me once again lisa um but i'd like to tag you don't have to do it guys um i'd like to tag Kieran Horn, yes Kieran, you don't have to do it mate, and also Harry White, so um, thanks for watching guys, and I will let you catch you next Wednesday, and happy Halloween.